one point out of this match and they'll look for a big start from here. We're in the Seba and he can blast a bit. Strike rate of 96.7 and the little master. Tendulkar will have to fire if India are in with a chance. Uh, Tendulkar gets off the mark. We'll look for two. Clark the fielder, in fact, picks up three. It's five without loss. Well, you don't go to him there. Marginally outside the line of the obstacle. As LA said, uh, not the worst delivery, but a fraction too short and a fraction too wide. And he's placed to pick the gap this time. This outfield is quick. It's a good start for Tendulkar. Well, the potting's got it wrong because this one goes just in front. Good batting, good placement. And he's found the gap again. Has it got enough to find the fence? Andrew Simon's the man, but the ball wins the race. Once again, not a particularly bad ball from Williams. Just swung away a little, and that gave Tendulkar the whip to work. Oh, that's a terrific shot, just weight forward over the ball. Nothing extravagant about it, just effective. This is the masterpiece. A master in full flow. Fourth boundary already. And what a player he is. Reaction fifth boundary. Gets the crowd excited. And a lot of people in the box excited. Stand and deliver. Too much width. It's in the air. Oh, he almost reached it. What a catch that it'll be. Damien Martin, fantastic effort. Almost got to it. Martin's fielding deep here. Right back at the edge of the circle. Oh, just got a fingertip to it. Hangs in the air for a long time, but he's so deep. And gone, he's put him down. Would you believe it? Matthew Hayden has put down a simple chance by his standards. And he had a good view of the edge. That first slip, the batsman opening the face, so that also is an early warning for a slip fielder. You can see here, opening the face, and those big hands are not in the right position taking the catch alongside him as they normally do that should have been taken nicely played there's some timing behind that one should be a four that's his first boundary just before that ball was bowled Danny the crowd got behind Sewa chanting Sewa Sewa to get him going he's got India's 15 Quite incredible. This is his 29th delivery faced. And it's the first time he's found the boundary rope. It's in a, oh, one of his favourite areas for him to say wag. Off his hip. Oh, it was well hit. And yeah, well fielded by Ricky Ponting, an Australian skipper. Oh. And the ball keeping low. Oh. And a direct hit might have been close. Well, it happened for India this time. It's Australia that have conceded the overthrows. Well, that is uncanny because it's a great pick up and throw from Michael Clark. Picks up one movement and a direct hit. And again, I think he was gone. And then into the almost into the chest there of Andrew Simons. He got round. Finally some aggression and the first six of the Indian innings. Slightly predetermined. But Red Footwork made room for himself, went inside out, made splendid contact with bat and ball, and went all the way. Fetch that. Another quick take it to them. Clear that cricket. Thoughtful batter. 76 for now. That's Andy Bickle continuing from the pavilion end. Big an age, but 
I go for four. But India certainly need a few of those. Perhaps a little finer. So like intended. Yes, indeed, he did open the face of the bat. He wanted to play it there. Played it almost to perfection because he got a hint of outside edge. After a shaky start, when the survey is just coming into form. Well, this is more like it from Sehwag. This is his very, very favorite area. Loves to cut, loves to cut hard. Sort of like an undercut on the jaw of the ball. Lifts it over the infield, gets four. And again he cuts again here, this could be six! This is really the shot that he loves to play. You don't bowl to him short, don't give him room outside the off stump. These are good batting conditions. That has really released the pressure from Sehwag. He's really launched into this one. And it's gone all the way. That's six more to the Indian total. Bickel is discovering Sehwag. Big 10 Dilkers 50, and this will be four. Well, Australia so calm under pressure of falling. And then Dilka picks up a boundary and yet another half century of just 45 deliveries. That was well played. Just into the gap. And just let's see what happens. It's a bad bounce. Slightly, maybe a little casual there. Oh, it's bowling him. He's trying to work that on the leg side. I'm not sure if he got inside edge, but that is exactly what Potting was trying to do. Harvey strikes, the 100 partnership comes to an end. Very entertaining stuff from Varinda Sawag. It sort of kept low, slightly low, played across it. That's the part of the gap there. We'll pick up a couple of videos, not sure. Oh, very rare sight. The Australian art of this feeling. Got a big smile on your face, isn't he, Ellis? Very rare sight. It's uh, timed well enough and deserved the boundary. But, uh, VVS. Anything through that leg side, he loves it. Randy Martin. That's a lovely little dab from Tim Dalton. He's going to pick up four for it. Ian Harkin wasn't impressed. He was looking at the umpire. He thought it was leg buys. This will give us a good indication. He likes to play that shot. The pal will find against the spinners, but this time he realizes the medium pace with Harvey. He give enough pace to play with it. Another top. And there it's beautiful. Ends with the boundary. Well, the last two overs have ended well for the Indians. Boundary is coming. The last ball of the previous over and uh, the one before that. Bickle once again. Just that margin of error for Tendulkar to free his arms. Goes for the ball. Makes good contact and the placement even better. Four is on the cards. Take the spinner on. Argument is he is a part-timer. Yeah, he's just a little too short. Searching Tendulkar. Well, he's not going to miss out on this. And up. Uh, oh. He's gone. Lakshman gone, Clark picks up a wicket, looks pretty ordinary but picks up important wickets, Michael Clark and a big one of VVS Lakshman. You could almost hear a pin drop. The Indian skipper walks in, Saro Ganguly, has been out of cricket for four weeks. VVS Lakshman trying to gain self a little bit of room but not getting the elevation and it's always good to have a tall man at short extra cover. Indian captain gets off the mark. An area where he loves the most. Square of the wicket in the offside. Gandhi goes for the spin up and gets a four. His first four of the innings. Well, that's a good positive move from the Indian uh, captain Saurav Gandhi. He was slated at coming in at number five. Promoted himself. He's gone ahead of Rahul Dravid realizing that India need to score at an average of around 8.5 and over. Left arm spinner is on, and this is what he can do to the left arm spinner. Can uh, the 
But that was unexpected for Gangoli. But good reaction to get two consecutive boundaries. This is where it gets difficult for the bowlers when they are bowling in the second half, especially the spinners. It's not very easy to grip the ball. That one clearly slipped out of the hands of Clark. Thank you very much, Sir of Ganguly. I've just come back after about a month's layoff, and this is what I need in the beginning. A couple of full tosses to get off the start, get off the blocks. Thank you very much. The Indian spinners. Another third consecutive full toss. The same result. We are just action replays for you in real time. I would love to see what next. Now this has not slipped out of his hand. This is pressure. This is nothing but pressure. Clark realizes that he's bowling to the best batsman in the world against spin bowling. The ball slipping out of his hand. The outfield is wet. The fielders also will struggle to really sprint in the deep. That ball has skidded through and Ian Harvey has struck again his second wicket and Tendulkar again for the second time in the series walking very disconsolate it happened in Mumbai and once again after getting a good score and able to get the big one bit of inside edge onto the pad Rahul Dravid has walked in Always get the distance comfortably, Saurav Ganguly. That's his first six. Saurav Ganguly against spinners. I think he's one of the best lifters I've seen. He could do that from the hospital bed as well. Full toss. has been smacked. Pass mid off. That's for Welcome boundary for India. 33 over is gone. And he's gone over the top. And that's gone all the way to four. Uh, can Drava do something a bit radical here because it's not in his nature. He likes to have time in the middle and feel bad on ball and play some more orthodox strokes. This is a bit different. Well, the run rate required is over eight, so Drava doesn't have time to play himself in. Being the Agnes of kind in the recent past, not really afraid to play his shots. It was in the right slot. The man with two wickets. It's a change of pace. Uh, that is very elegant. Not the easy shot to play against somebody like Ian Hardy who has a good change of pace. Just in the slot, hitting on the rise. We've seen a couple of batsmen struggle with it. Not Rahul Rahul, but waiting for the ball. He's gone over the top, man getting underneath it, and he's taken it. Andrew Simons picks up an important wicket of the Indian captain. Andy Bickle, the man in the deep, had no problems. Yuvraj Singh, the new man in. He's found the gap. Yuvraj Singh loves it. What a great hit. Chased down 325. And he played a big part, Yuvraj Singh. <laughs> <laughs> nice little bit of ball play from the bowler. And Shepard's confused. What's going on? But very clear Ian Harvey. Saw the movement early and then held on to it. Okay, Rahul. Play your game. Gilchrist saw the lighter side of it as well. Oh. Worked it away quite nicely. You brought single to the second boundary. Harvey cursing himself. He sits about middle going into league. Cannot afford to get into middle and league with Indians with the elasticated wrists. Beautiful flick. He knew it. Once again, this time fine. Gets to the practice pitches. And it beats the fielder. Consecutive boundaries to India. And he's gone. What a catch. Could be the catch of the tournament. It's a tall man by Kukasperich. He had to get down in time. He's firmly struck by Rahul Dravid. But he's on his way back. Important wicket coming again the Aussie's way. Goes to the big shot and he's given him. Jack Prakash doesn't take too much time, and I think it's a pretty straightforward one. Well, certainly not if you're out. Straight away. Look at that spearing it in, full. 
No problems with that. It's pitched in line into the back leg and hit off stump. Short one or bowl to the tail end of Zahir Khan. 42 overs gone. And there's a, throw, and there's a shout. Didn't slide the bat. Zahir Khan, is this the Cardinal Sin? Oh, I think that's history. F foot or bat or anything, foot over the line, he's gone. That's out of here. Oh, oh it doesn't matter. Case dragged it on, trying to drag Simons into the top layer of the stand. Last ball of the innings. Anil Kumble will pick up a single. India will finish at 286 for 8. And there it is. Australia win by 61 runs. Time for handshakes.